This is a 1918 model 735 Stanley. And this was the next model after our 1916 car. Well, the one thing they changed too was the, uh, the dash appearance. They brought the gauges up onto an actual dash panel where you can read them easier. Uh, you might want to see if you can photograph the dash here, which shows the instruments up where the where the driver can see them. The earlier cars had them down closer to your feet on the firewall. And then in the back of the car, as I mentioned, this has the seven passenger or longer body with the jump seats here for the extra passengers. So they called it seven because it was two in front, two on the jump seats and three on the back seat. Seven passenger. Seven passenger cars became very popular uh, about the end of World War I. Uh, prior to that, uh, I don't know whether the whole family didn't go or whether the families weren't as large, but uh, it became desirable uh, in this period where there were no station wagons or SUVs or anything. So it was uh, uh, this configuration with the small uh, little seats or jump seats that fold up and down were very popular. Oftentimes, I guess the children, the smaller children, rode on the jump seats.